Namaste Soul Tribe Spiritual Healer back to give you guys a message. Hi Fire Signs, my beautiful Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius watching this video. I have very important messages for you guys, very important um, channel message that just came through a few minutes ago. I wasn't going to do a video today, but this um, channel message came right through to me right away. I wrote them down right away, and here I am recording this video. Spirit says, this message has to be put out, okay? So, um, my beautiful fire signs, I'm getting this energy of the generational curse that you were sent here to break. Um, let's talk about that. So, for the individuals that are going to resonate with this video, for my fire signs watching that resonate, you guys know you have a significant generational curse that you came here to break in your family okay a family member like a group of family members this is for a lot of you that are resonating with this video it's like a group of family members and these parents that took an oath that took an oath to work with the dark forces these people's vessels has been taken over Okay, so these family members have been also body snatched by entities. These are not the same people that you used to know. These people were always dark, but now they are even darker. They're desperate. Supernatural events, okay, trying to cause your demise with supernatural events occurring in your life, in your home, in your cars, at your job, okay, with equipment or um, electronics, Acting crazy, acting out of sorts, so be careful. I'm getting this message that if any of you guys work with sharp objects at work, or like you work with a, a, in a construction site, or you work with like a construction site, I heard that again, at a construction site with tools or power tools or whatever you're working with, even if you work in a salon and you use scissors or anything sharp, wherever you're working at, whatever you do for work, this is a specific message. Be careful because there's a dark witch that has come to, to your job or at your workplace that has left a hex there that wants you to um, literally die in a real weird way, like a freak accident happening. So be careful when you're using tools or sharp objects. Be careful when you're driving as well. There's a dark entity force or attachment that has gotten into your car before you gave this person a ride or they literally um, did something with your car while you wasn't around or this person threw a hex at your car. Be careful. If you're driving too fast, I would advise you to slow down. They're trying to cause you an accident. They want your brakes to give out. They want your car to act crazy. They want your car to shut off in mid traffic. So be careful. Be careful. Get your cars checked. Check your car under your seats in your car. If anybody left a shirt of theirs, an item of theirs, something that was cursed in your car, check your cars, check your homes, check your workspace. This is a direct warning here. A group of family members choosing to sacrifice their own children or child are going to be sent to purgatory. And that's another message that I'm getting. These, these family members don't even understand that they're being purged out of Mother Gaia, that we are shifting to a higher, um, like, we're shifting to a higher timeline, another dimension. We're literally shift, shifting um, to New Earth, okay? And when we have this major shift to New Earth... These family members are going to be stuck in a dark dimension, which is this dimension, which is going to be darker because this dimension is going to be, um, this is, dimension is going to be infested with flesh eating zombies. Wow. That's, that's a message. I got to download. I just wrote all this, this shit down really fast. And this is what I came up with. This is what I heard. A dark dimension, which is purgatory, which is a, a, a dimension full of destruction and flesh eating zombies. So get away from these people. They have been body snatched, okay, by dark entities, dark forces causing supernatural events, trying to cause you a car accident or accident at work. Use um use dragon's blood, I heard, or smudge your home, your car, your office, wherever you are at work, okay? Wow, wear black obsidian at this time. Um, we have to wear black obsidian, Spirit says. Um, yeah, light a protection candle. They know that you are the beneficiary, so these people know you're the beneficiary of someone's home, estate, property, or fortune, and this is why they really want to stop you, block you, take you out for this money also. They also know that you came here to break this generational curse, and that's why you're being gifted this huge fortune, and they want to stop everything for you. They want to take you out completely. 
Definitely, there's crooked official members involved, crooked people, crooked cops, crooked lawyers. My nose just started itching all crazy. Okay. I heard the name Sarah. I heard the name Stacy. I heard the name Sheila. I heard the name Lauren. I heard the name Imani. Iman or Imani. George or Georgia. Somebody could be from Georgia. I heard Georgia. I heard George. Spirit, give me the messages for the fire sign with this warning that they're trying to cause them an accident or try to cause them to have a freak accident or they're sending some sort of voodoo or hex towards their, their life right now. These dark forces are taking over people's cars. A lot of accidents happening on the roads. People having tragic accidents. Be careful. Yes, this is someone that has a devil energy as well. This, this is like people that wanted to bind you and keep you stuck to them. This is a major generational curse. You guys, congratulations for those of you because this card actually came out in reverse. Yes, I do reversals because there's two messages to every card. There's two energies. A, a card holds good energy, bad energy. Okay, regardless of what, this card in reverse means that you guys actually have breaking, broken a generational curse. You guys have actually broken some sort of bondage or attachment or energy that was stuck to you or wanted to keep yourself stuck to you. Okay, you guys have defeated this. And so now these supernatural events could be happening in these people's lives, these karmics. They could be having um, power outages. They could be having their cars... Um, crashing or, or not working or stopping or actually accidents happening to them there you guys are um gonna start to notice that people are dying off around you like people are falling off like okay so people are losing their minds some people are actually dying from freak accidents or having like committing suicide i heard what well, these entities are really coming back to collect. And um, if you guys are still dealing with these people, they can actually have this happen to you. They can actually project that energy and it can work on you if you're actually still attached to them in some sort of way. But this is the Ten of Pentacles. This is why they want to take you out, my beautiful fire signs. This is why for the Ten of Pentacles. I heard Henry. Bill or Billy or Brejan, wow, somebody like wants to, wanted to keep you stuck in trap, but this card came out in reverse as well, someone didn't want you to have a lot of options, because the options card came down in reverse, so someone wanted you to be stuck without options, wanted to be codependent on them, wanted to keep you stuck, but you guys are liberated yourself from these people, you're no longer stuck, because if you were stuck, it would have been in, in the upright, you guys are getting liberated yourselves, you guys, um, these people are going to have to deal with the consequences. So whatever they had gained or benefited off of you, off of your inheritance, off of your energy, off of trying to sacrifice, they're going to lose it all. They're going to have to pay it all to you tenfold with the Ten of Pentacles. Okay? Someone was actually trying to sell a property or an estate or a home that belonged to you and they're not getting away with it. You have a lot of proof or there's a lawyer that has proof or someone is an official person. Okay? Hmm. Page of Cups in reverse. This could be a child. Someone was trying to sacrifice a child, or someone's child, or someone's trying to sacrifice their own child um, to get out of this because someone's trapped. Are they going to go to jail for this and they're trying to sacrifice their own child for it? Or someone could be losing their child, their home. They could go to jail. They could lose their child. Page of Cups in reverse. Some of you guys, they couldn't even try to take your children from you to do this because you have a chosen child, so be mindful. Someone could have also lost a child, like your child could have passed, someone's child could have passed away here because of these people using their dark magic arts and it affected a child. My condolences to anybody that lost a child, I'm very sorry, but you will have judgment. Here goes the judgment card here. Your ancestors are calling judgment on these people as we speak. Yeah, the death card. You walking away, you letting go is causing a lot of people's demise around you because you broke free from their curse or trap. Ace of Wands in the upright is an unexpected turn of events that's coming towards you. Ace of, Ace of Wands in reverse is some of you guys are going to find out that this water sign was actually sleeping with someone in your family, was actually having sex with this person, trying to keep you stuck in the trap in a toxic connection or relationship with them. 
this person is going down with them. Nine of Cups in the upright is you receiving blessings and rewards from the divine for all your hard works, fire signs. Okay, this is not going to be a very long reading, okay? Nine of Wands in reverse is someone that, exactly, someone that was trying to keep you stuck with love spells and sex magic, lying to you, connected to karmics, working against you, someone that your family try to send in to try to um, keep you stuck and bound here and try to work against you. That person could be passing away. This person could have a sudden freak accident. Mm. That's Aries Leo Sag energy as well. There's Pisces Cancer Scorpio energy. There's Capricorn energy, Virgo Taurus energy. Mm -hmm. There's even um, Libra Gemini or Aquarius energy. Temperance is the angels are filling up your cup. The divine is sending you your blessings. You work very hard. Some of you guys are going to have this windfall of money. Some of you guys are just headed towards your success, major blessings in your success, your business. You moved away from the chaos and conflict. Now they're fighting amongst one another because the sun card is here. Something's going in your favor, being illuminated. The star card is you are the star. Beautiful magicians, okay? You guys could be in the spotlight, could be coming in the spotlight, could be actor, singer, artist, okay? Okay, reader, speaker, healer, whatever you do, you could um, transform people's lives here. You could also be working in the beauty industry, making some sort of beauty product or doing hair, hairstylist energy. Wow, listen, you guys became the hermit when you went within and found out about this mother figure of Queen of Swords karmic and you stood your ground because this karmic was actually in cahoots with this ex-lover or these family members to sacrifice this mother figure here or this family member female family member, right? Wow. <sighs> can't make it up, guys. I can't. I just can't. I'm not even going to pull this deck, actually. I was going to, but these people are actually dreaming about you guys because everything is backfiring onto them. I'm being guided to pull the Starseed deck. There's going to be some sort of evidence in your favor if you're going to court. If you don't even know about this court case that's been going on behind the scenes, you're going to get communication about this evidence in your favor here. Wow. Yup. And some of you guys are reuniting with a soulmate that they use separation spells and conflict spells between you guys. They did this to both of you guys. You guys will be reuniting. The angels are helping you through this period, fire signs. You're about to get that bag of money. Yep, you need that spiritual bath ASAP. Activate all your chakras. Work on your chakras. Work on meditations, please, guys. Because you guys, some of you guys connect to the Palladian star seeds. I heard Joseph or Joe. Joanne. Jenny. I heard Jennifer or Jenny. Janelle. Janet. Love spells are going backwards. Lawyer is paid off. Yup, this one lawyer was paid off. They're getting jail time for this. They're getting exposed. Yup, spiritual bath came out again. Someone is very crooked in the justice system. Crooked judge. These people are going to have to step down. They're getting exposed. There's major investigation. Okay, people's um, phone calls are being tapped right now. They're listening to them. Their phone calls, they got proof of emails. They got payouts that went through. People getting paid for doing things like that. There's receipts. Self-love is making you more attractive. And if they was trying to get you caught up in a, in a court case justice system, they cannot prove that you're guilty. You will be exonerated. You, you, you will win this case. Let go of toxic people. Oh, my gosh. This energy is heavy. I need to light my Palo Santo. I feel this energy is heavy. It's like feeling like this back of my neck is getting tight, like someone's grabbing me. So someone could be trying to like um, grab you or do something to you while you're sleeping. Make sure you're not sleeping with the enemy. You're not sleeping with someone you don't trust. Be mindful of that. I just felt like someone was grabbing me from the back of my neck. It creeped me out. Okay, so this energy is very heavy. Fire signs, I'm just letting you know now. Okay? Communication is coming. 
There's some communication coming towards you guys. Cleanse the energy from my space. Cleanse the energy of the cards. Protect me, ancestors and, and spirit guides and Archangel Michael, as I deliver this message for the fire signs. These family members have been body snatched. Please don't trust these people. Get away from them. Don't trust them. Don't eat their food. I'm telling you right now, you guys could be dealing with a heavy air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy coming out. Stolen lawsuit money, settlement or inheritance. Okay, self-defense. You might have to defend yourself from these people. Some of these people are planning to come into your home when you're sleeping. Come into your home when you're not there. Be careful. Awakening suddenly. Maybe you're um, sleeping and you hear a noise and you wake up out of nowhere in your home and it freaks you out. Be mindful. Get your cameras. Do what you got to do. Buy a gun. New information coming. Daddy issues. Yep, orchestrated trauma with your fathers moving away. Some of you finding out your father's not even your damn fathers. Don't dim your light to fit in. Somebody's going to jail. They're going to get a year or so in jail. I know where you live. I'm healing. You guys are healing. Father's involved. No jail time. You guys are innocent. Someone's going to be caught on surveillance camera or, or a camera. Mm, this person's playing victim, but they're not. They're not a victim. They're going to have to see you winning. This person actually... um. It's crooked. They have a background. They play victim, though. This person's been in jail before. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to get some messages from this deck before I end this video because this energy is very heavy, guys, and I just really want to hang up. I mean, I said hang up. Wow. Okay, so you guys might really want to hang up the phone on somebody. Somebody's going to try to call you and um, start some shit with you on the phone. Or maybe you're a reader and you're giving someone a reading and you just want to hang up the phone because this person's energy is giving you a headache. Be mindful who you're reading for. If you're a reader, I got that message out of nowhere. And if you're getting a phone call from someone, they're projecting dark energy or they're talking in riddles or they're talking in circles. They're trying to do a spell on you over the phone. Hang the hell up. Wow, that was a message. So nothing is a coincidence in tarot. I was about to say I want to end this video and I said I want to hang up. So you guys might want to hang up once you get that bad energy. Once you feel the back of your neck start to get cringy or something. Wow, guys. There's a lot of messages coming through. My crown chakra is lit. Sex crimes. These people are involved with a group of people that commit sex crimes. Or um, someone has committed sex crimes. Someone touched children or someone did. A major tower. They're going to jail. Hmm. You've been outcasted by family because you were, you're the goat, you're the starseed, you're the chosen one. Having dreams about these people trying to take you out. Mm. Wow, that's crazy. Setting you up is really backfiring on them. They're working with someone with the last name Smith. Someone that has the last name Smith here. Jealous sister betrayal exposed. Dealing with fa father's betrayal. Mother, mother try to blood sacrifice you here. Wow. Twin flame is watching you. Let go of these people because mm, they're working with dark forces. And the, you don't know what these people are even capable of. They're so desperate to take you guys out for this fortune, for this inheritance. So just be mindful. Put some Himalayan salt around your properties. Okay? Really, really uh, protect your energy right now. Fire signs. This is, was an important message, a channel message for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Till the next time. If you need a personal reading, reach out to me down below. Okay? And love you guys so much. Namaste.